<laughs> Welcome back. Um, it is now 12-11 on... I'm not going to date the video. I was going to say what day it was. <laughs> <laughs> um, but welcome back to Adventures of Gaming, guys. Um, hey, if we're having everybody. a good time. Um, we've hit that point where we're starting getting Wait, shit headed. Wait, I want to unlock that, right? You want to hit the box. I don't think you got the box last episode. No, I did. Oh, you did? Probably. Okay. So, yeah, we're I want to unlock forward. that thing. Um, we're going to try to get to the boss. <laughs> we're going to try to get to the boss door in this episode. Oh, um, yeah, that shouldn't be a problem. Maybe. If not, we'll just make it a longer episode because, you know, yeah, we've not? had a decent amount of... Okay, I'm just going to do something else then. Um, oh, wait, wait. Can you look at the door one more time? This door? Yeah. So, zoom. go backwards. No, 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 oh. no. Go back toward the heart ah, container ah, thing. Ah, and ah. then, like, look up at the door. So, you see how it has, like, the two eyes and it, like, you know, so you see the things with, like, the, the <laughs> leaves off it. He's, like, I got his arms up it. in there. He's, like, going, oh, my God! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I haven't noticed that before. Um, All right. Is this where we came in? No. We want to unlock No, we want to so go there's through there. There's a switch. Oh, you know what? This is probably a good spot to save also, because oh. we haven't saved in a while. Oh, yeah. No, we haven't. Um, okay. I haven't been up here yet, so... Because everything's still alive. Decapitate. Oh, I missed. You missed. Ah! Oh, you okay. almost totally that, missed. Yeah, that's all that mattered, though. I hit that. You know, this is the other thing that bothers me. How many of these beetles can Link make at a time? Because... What do you mean? Oh, no, it does it fly comes, back it to It comes him. back, yeah. Because, like, it loses power. It dies. And, like, you know, that's the one thing that bothers me, because it just... How it, it somehow back. just yeah, shows it comes back, back. Maybe Link has, like, a magnetic pulse, repulsion thing coming back toward it or something. Because, like, there's obviously some sort of Skyloft energy coming in to play within this game, and even the... Is this back at the beginning? No. No, okay. Because even the next game... What was that, a heart? I don't yeah, want a heart. The Sky... The... Not Skyward Sword, but the Zelda 2016... At this point, I'm just going to say it again, the game hasn't come out yet. And I'm still infuriated that it hasn't come out yet. I'm also infuriated that there's no information about the game what? whatsoever yet. So, bam. I'm speculating that it's somewhere in between the events of Twilight Princess and Majora's Wait, no, Mask. There's something, yeah, there it is. I knew there was something else in this. Somewhere story. between I'll the events of Scott, Twilight Princess <laughs> and, <laughs> and Skyward Sword. Oh, fuck. <gasps> Twilight Princess and the other one. What's in here? Majora's Mask. Oh, God, that scared me. <laughs> nope, nope, where are you? Nope. Uh, Bam. do the spin attack. Oh, there, there you go. go. Die! Nice. Um, so, because, like, there's energy, Shoot. and there's powers and stuff, like, and I don't know, I have no idea what to expect with this game, because it's open world, it's Skyward Sword-esque looking, it's in a land that doesn't have much to do with like any like landscape or anything, so it's not anywhere near the time frame of Ocarina of Time. So it could be as early as Skyward Sword, or like a sequel to Skyward Sword, or it could be in between the events of Majora's Mask and, Sky and uh, Twilight Princess, where the hero of time is surviving, trying to find Navi still, but he's grown into an adult. It could be part of that, like, before mm -hmm. he gets lost in the Stalfos rule. It's like, me and you have had a long conversation about that theory of the Stalfos link being the hero of time with yeah. the different things about it. Um, and I, I have no idea what to expect. Like, I'm, one, I'm infuriated, but two, I'm also, like, very intrigued to see how Nintendo is going to portray Link and the story and how it's going to work with the original game. You're too far, you're too close. You have to pull it back farther. You're, I think, where you had it the first time you were right. A little bit, a little bit more. Oh, no, that's good. Um. <laughs> this is still so funny. It was like, look at me, look at me, look at me. <laughs> yeah, get way more into it, George. You gotta go, Come on. Woo! There you <laughs> go. <laughs> yeah, you had to say something. Sorry, sound effects were necessary. Ah. <laughs> I like how we've kind of worked out the unspoken rule that whenever one of us is drinking our milk, someone else has to talk for a minute. <laughs> <laughs> um, dun, 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 dun. Okay, so we got the key. Oh, good. Oh, good. <laughs> oh, welcome back to Game of Thrones. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> so, that, so that stuff is my favorite. Like, I, we talked about this when we first started this session. We Man. love Game Grumps. Like, to the to the point of it's an un unhealthy obsession but, with the Game Grumps. Um, but it's still a healthy obsession. Cause it's, and bap. Cause it's, I don't know what that does. Water level? Yeah. Neat. Um... <clears throat> 
Yeah, he's still standing there. Come on, buddy. Come, Come on, on back. And choop. It must be some sort of, some sort of magnet or something that just kind of lets it. Probably. Or maybe it just loses its flight powers and then it can still crawl back and it just like jumps from the ground onto his wrist. You know? I don't know. Something you, like that. you said something that's like, you know, it must have so much power. But I mean, what if it just like takes like, into the fact that like the amount of power it has is minus the amount of power it needs to get back. Right. Because like that or, or like maybe his wings just get tired or like because there's some like things like I have a bunch of remote control helicopters. They don't fly for too long. I mean, they last for a bit, but then if you shut them off, turn them back on again, they'll start flying pretty quickly. Like, I mean, they'll fly for another, like, five minutes if you turn them off and plug them back on for a second. Right. Um, I mean, and even then, it's, they still don't work the best. I mean, but, like, and, and this is, like, the first model. It's been stuck in a chest for whatever long, right? Yeah. I mean, and also it's ancient. Like, there's no upgrades or anything to it. Um, yeah, I know, Uncle Sai. It's, it's struggle life over there hanging on a log um oh i forgot we already killed all those guys sick just the sick backflip bro back on, get back on, get back on, get back is this leading to the boss key Shabap-bap. probably i don't know i haven't checked the map in a while i it's just good. know where i'm going yeah that's a good point yeah like we were we were talking about before we know this dungeon really uh oh spaghetti -o. I forgot about that actually. <laughs> Knows dungeon pretty well, besides the fun stuff. Come on, I need seeds. Oh my god. We don't well, need for this. Probably don't one. need seeds. Yeah, but I think we're all I set with seeds. <gasps> <laughs> oh right, I was supposed to tell you guys what my favorite uh, ah, my favorite answer. Zelda um item was. Um, there you go. What was it? Shit, I had it in my head too. I can't remember what it was now. Chink. Mm -hmm. I really like the double claw shot. Yeah. Yeah, I always liked the concept of being able to have like a grappling hook kind of a thing. Like I like, mm -hmm. I watched a lot of superhero stuff when I was a kid, mostly Batman. So being able to have a grip shot kind of a thing would be freaking <gasps> awesome. But the physics of it just doesn't work. <laughs> yeah. I no, mean, I I like them, but like the one thing I don't like about it is like Yes. Um, they're not very good for killing. Well, I mean, they can kill the small things, but like mostly they're just for stunning. Yeah, I mean, but in in Twilight Princess especially, they really put you on like there was one dungeon where you use them a lot, the mm -hmm. Sky Dungeon, but can oh, just kill oh, them. right, yeah. there we go. And but but besides that, you don't really use them too often, but they were used oh. so so ornately and so well in that dungeon that you just. <laughs> You really know, like, that's what they're made for. That's what the ah. point of it is. Um, yeah. Yeah, no. They, they did it pretty well in uh, Twilight Princess. I was okay with it in this one. Yeah, I mean, I, I can't remember how they're using this Can't argue, one. of course, but right. like, that's why I couldn't open that door this, from this freaking side. But we still have to get that. How do we get the heart container? Why don't we go do that really quick? Let's go find the heart container. The or, heart container? Yeah, because it's in the oh, cage balls. over there. On the other In the other room. See, it's right there. How Bad do... heart container. Oh, oh, oh. I'll fly the beetle all the way up to the very top. That's it. See? I know this dungeon. Whee! You guys might not think it. Oh, we'll get the, cr the crate Too as late. well. We're going up. The crate has the 50 rupees in it, I think. We're going up. Okay. Crate next. Oh, that's it. Moving on up. Oh. Eh. Now we're good. Noise. <laughs> um. Noise. All right, Jordan. Next question. Favorite Zelda game? Because you, I know you really Twilight love Princess. Majora's Mask. Really, you do. Uh, you uh, you got Twilight Princess down. Definitely. Right. I'm the same like, way. Majora's Mask is the first Zelda game I completely beat by but yourself. Twi no walkthroughs or anything. By myself, no walkthroughs, no nothing. But Twilight Princess is the game, the first game. It's behind there. That where? Ooh. Twilight Princess is the game that, like, me, my brother, and our friend played through. Yeah. And so, like, so, like, I think Twilight Princess, I don't know if it was the first game I beat, but it's the first game I saw the ending to. Right. For me, Sky Also, uh, I really like Midna. For me, I, Twilight Princess is my favorite game as well, but for a different reason. Mm -hmm. I only had played- Are you gonna walk this girl? I only- oh. <laughs> come on, buddy. I only had played Lanes of the Past- and oh oh no spaghetti -o. <laughs> he beat me at my own game 
he knew exactly what was going on. Boy, I'm gonna kill you. I had only played. I'm gonna kill you hard. Oh, this is my favorite part of this game. Run, bitch. <laughs> oh shit! It's a beetle. <laughs> um, I've okay, only... I'm gonna walk across here. At the point of me being my there Zelda you go. player, I've played. I played uh, Skyward. I'm sorry. Link See to, you in Link hell. to the Past on the DS. I'm sorry, the Game Boy mm -hmm. and the SNES. SNES. I've played, um, and then I played the Four Swords Adventures for the GameCube. But besides those games, I had never played an actual Zelda game. I never, I couldn't, I never found our Wind Waker copy until a lot later. Um, oh, and close. then sorry. my mom found when she, we were cleaning out one of our computer rooms, she found her copy of the GameCube version, the GameCube port of Ocarina of Time. Mm -hmm. So I had played that, but I didn't, I liked that. Oh, wait, what am I talking about? Ocarina of Time is the first, the one I ever played. Right. Because me and me, we had like the collector's edition had From Ocarina. Grandpa, yeah. Yeah. It had Ocarina of Time, Majora's Mask, Wind Waker, one, two. Yeah. It had everything. Yeah. Um, but of, of course, right. Ocarina of Time being the game that it yeah. is was See, that, obviously the most prominent. That's the thing. Ocarina of Time is the most prominent, but it's still not, it didn't connect with me as much. Now, oh my god, I need one more seed. No, I can hit it. I just right. turned 13. Um, the Wii was just coming out. We, uh, the, like, it was a launch, Twilight Princess was a launch title for the Wii. You knew that, right? Yeah. The original Wii system that came with it. And not only that, but the Wii, the Wii system and uh, I can't Twilight make Princess. That, can I? No, you can't make that one. Okay. You have to go through the, the thing. Right. Um, so Twilight Princess completely. Fuck. Released for the GameCube and the Wii at the same time, mm -hmm. same like month. I think it was a little bit off. I think the Wii took a little bit longer to finish up. But then, I got my Wii console, and then we got Wait, Twilight Princess. Go? Oh, maybe you do you have to jump in there. Sorry. It looks like a long one. I'm tired. Oh, maybe I can get it. I don't know. Let's find out. Nope. nope. <laughs> maybe it's a go around. Oh no, but that's the boss. Yeah, that's that's, the that's where the gate is. Uh, oh, you gotta climb up and you gotta swing all the way across. There's vines in that. Right. Yeah. Um, yeah, it just knocked it down. So I don't know why I didn't continue. I started playing Twilight Princess, and I don't know how many of you have seen Twilight Princess start and anything, but the whole thing with Ilya and her getting kidnapped and, like, hit Link running to rescue his his love interest. Like, I mean, I she's really definitely... like Ilya. I, I do. Yeah, I know. She's your favorite. I, I'm, it's like... I'm not a fan. I... Well, I mean, it's just like... Cause do you know who I really hate? Colin. Oh, Colin. <laughs> the kid. Me and Aaron joke about him all the time. I, um, he's, he's a little puss. So, but I... I made an emotional connection with that. Because at the time, my imagination, I would run away with everything. And so I was always, like, putting myself in Link's shoes at that point. Mm -hmm. And I had a lot of very close friends who were female in that time frame. But I had lost a lot of their friendships. Like, I just kind of disconnected from them. And so I was really connecting with this game in particular. 20 bucks, I wasn't going to miss this. <laughs> <laughs> um, Money, please. <laughs> oh, my God. Um, I had so, every intent to actually make that, though. So. Yeah. And it's, so uh, you might want to go stop swinging and go down yeah, a little bit. I'm gonna. Um, and... So I was playing through Twilight Princess and everything with Midna, especially with the halfway point in the game where Midna gets sick. Like, I dude, I dude, was so playing through that just a couple days ago. I was like crushed all over. I know. Again. I oh my. Anyway, the that Zelda game is the first game that anyway. gave me emotion, and it was the first one that had an actual story that like it really. <sighs> It really caught with oh me, and God. I've never been able to let it go. I've played it so many times, but mm -hmm. I can never remember how to do everything on it. And I've only played the Wii version. I've never played the GameCube version. So going to the Wii U version now, I'm getting the full Twilight Princess experience by playing both halves of the game that I've never seen before. So I'm really getting the full uh, the full 180 Jesus. of getting the entire story. Yeah. Plus, I mean, we're going to do it for our channel. And like this is a new part of our lives is this YouTube channel. And it's like, woo! It's, Sorry, that just took <laughs> way too long. It's one of those things where I'm just so do excited. We, do we want to make this a long episode and just finish up here? Do you want to do the whole boss? Yeah, sure. 
Uh, is there more boss than I remember? There is more boss than you remember. Okay. There's two. There's two stages. Of there is. Yeah. Okay. Um, because he. We'll, we'll we'll show you guys next time. We'll we'll at least get the key in the door, and then we'll pause. Yeah, we we can we can start the next one with getting the, getting okay. the key in the door. We'll do oh, that. can I put the key in the door? Yes, you can. Okay, I hate it. <laughs> so um, literally like when me and Jacob play through this, yeah, he always did it. But uh, but anyway, so Twilight Princess is my by far favorite Zelda game. All of you can eat a dick if you don't like it. Sorry. Okay, no, <laughs> no, not that much. Uh, that's for me though. You don't. You okay. might not think the same way, but no, I don't. I I don't know. I really you love. Do you. I I love Twilight Princess. Um, Skyward Sword is right up there with it though. I I really do enjoy this one. But I'm a fan. Um, motion I, controls are a little iffy. That's but the problem. Other than that, no, I'm um, pretty. I'm I'm pretty okay with Majora's it. Mask would probably be two or two to three. I think t I think Skyward Sword and Majora's Mask are tied for me. Um, I I'd put Majora's Mask above. Yeah. Um. Then Ocarina of Time. I know Ocarina of Time is like a fan favorite, but there's yeah, a lot I'm of a huge fan of Ocarina yeah, of Time. Yeah, that's the thing. It's like I play I it a know. lot. Um, like I mean, I guess I can't remember the last time I've played all the way through it. Cause like the last time I played all the way through it was a really long time ago with Jacob and yeah. Cody. Cause mm -hmm. like I don't know. And a little kid, me going up against. Cause like that was one of the first like. Cause I mean I played games before but like that game is such a long game it is it's so, like as a little kid going through like eight different temples with stuff before that and it's just like i don't even know what's going on anymore. yeah it's like you lose track of the actual story yeah um, like that's why i liked majora's mask because like while it was a shorter game it was like i don't know yeah it's it's one of those things i'm just gonna go ahead and shield bash so you guys aren't just looking at nothing all right um it's one of those things where you kind of just go and you do what you need to. Oh, do we save already? You saved already. Yes. All right. Well, we're, we'll keep we'll keep rambling next time. Uh, we're gonna fight the boss. We're gonna focus on that. Then we'll keep going with the story, the actual storyline of the game. So, thank you for joining us in Adventures of Gaming. And until next time, adventure on. <laughs> we did ramble for a lot this one. Yeah. <laughs>